my name's Osh Babani and you're watching me on MissMalini.com. <laughs> Kind of, of a conditioning-ish textured product in my hand, evenly in the hand, and then just in the ends, basically, mm -hmm. scrunch it into the ends. So I'm not not putting anything on the scalp, and then when I put hardly anything in my hand, mm -hmm. then I can go a little bit further up the head. But at no stage I'm like just slapping it on the scalp. Mm -hmm. okay. There's hardly anything on your hands when I can come to the front of it, yeah? Just to make sure you've got the product to be very nice and really good. And maybe if you were at home, and you want to just let your hair up, hair dry out, and you don't want to use a hair dryer, you can take some kind of bone turn and twist it. Just pin it up like this for some time, maybe half an hour because your hair's quite long. Um, and then you just let it drip. Let it fall down for maybe half an hour and just slowly, slowly, that's it. Open up, open up. And it'll be a much nicer curl. So the kind of curl that we see now with the dry, we can get that a little bit now, okay? And then you just sit it up. And as comfortable as you can, you can get it on it and forward, yeah? And you just make sure that the roots get really well dried off at this point. Yeah. Amrita's hair, uh, we had a little bit of excessive length, even though she likes her length, we uh, decided to take that up a little bit, a few inches, so that we get a more full feeling through the outline. Uh, we then layered her hair a little bit. It had some layers in it before. We added a little bit of more layering internally. And then we did a little bit of detail through the front, which I think she really likes, which is the small fringe kind of section which we took. Uh, and that kind of covers her forehead a little bit, flicking off nicely to the side, I can see right now. So uh, I think it's gone really, really well.